Hi Capricorn, welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody's doing well. We're going to do your messages from Spirit and the Angels. Please know that this reading can be about any area of your life. So just really listen to the messages and you will know how they resonate with you. I am giving away one free personal reading each month. If you'd like to enter the giveaway, you just need to be a subscriber, like the video, and leave a comment. I will post the winner the first week of every month. So with that Capricorn, let's just get started. I'm going to pull a couple cards here from the Archangel Power Tarot deck. So your first card here is the Five of Raphael. Everything happens for a reason. Release regret and embrace the opportunities for happiness and search for the silver lining. Okay, so let's see what else we have. The bottom of the deck here. We have the two of Michael. It will all be better if you just make a decision over analyzing a problem and finding a compromise. Okay. And then let's see what else we have here. We have the eight of Gabrielle. A great deal of activity, sudden and immediate results and important communication. Okay. So I'm almost getting with this energy. There's a situation I feel here, Capricorn, with the five of uh, Raphael, right? There's definitely an energy here. There may be some disappointment, some sadness for some of you. Um, and I feel like it's bringing you to make some sort of decision. But with this to a Michael, that can be that energy of being at odds with yourself, right? You can't really find... Um, that compromise between your head and your heart to make a final decision, okay? And, and you may be even, some of you may be even overthinking it. So there's some sort of decision here I feel like you're having to make. And I feel with this aid of Gabrielle that either some sort of communication comes in to help you make some sort of decision or after you make a decision here, right, things start to gain momentum, start, things start to move. So we'll see with the tarot, we're going to see how that plays out for you. Uh, Capricorn, so let's pull some more cards. Let's see what else the energy shows here. What can you show Capricorn? What else does Capricorn need to know? What else can you show Capricorn? What does Capricorn need to know? Thank you, angels and spirit, for your guidance. All right. <clears throat> okay. So first card you have here is the King of Pentacles. We have the Ace of Cups. Interesting. And we have here the Ten of Wands. Okay. Okay. All right, so really what this is showing me, right, with this five of Raphael, I feel there's a situation that is happening. Okay, you got the hermit here as well. I feel there's a situation where you're not feeling stability or security in the situation. And like I said, it can be around anything. It can be around work, career, a love situation, a friendship, right, even a family member. It feels like with this, uh, King of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands and the Ace of Cups. I'm going to say a lot of you, this is a love situation. So you may be feeling like you're not supported in a love situation or with a loved one, not getting the stability or security that you need from this person. And with the Hermit card, I'm seeing here as well that this has really made you think, really, is what I see here, right? You're trying to search for those answers. You're trying to go within you know, using your intuition, using your logic here, finding the right path and really uh, down to your soul, right? Finding that path to find your way in making some sort of decision here. So let's see what else we have. Okay, there we have the Ace of Pentacles. We have the Eight of Pentacles. Oh boy. <laughs> and we have the lovers. Okay, so we got strong Gemini energy. We have your energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We also have here Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. And with this two, Michael, we also have air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. 
<clears throat> okay. So yes, this is what it's telling me here, right? With this King of Pentacles and this Ace of Pentacles, right? This decision I feel like you're having to make Capricorn is really a decision for the long term, right? Is their growth, is their prosperity in, the, in this situation, whether it's around your money, finances, um, a loved one or a relationship here. You have here the Ace of Cups. You've got the Eight of Coin here as well. So some of you, this may be around employment. This may be around, right, doing, you know, maybe finding a job or doing a job, something that you love to do. <clears throat> um, some of you, this is around love, right? Whether the decision may, do I put, do I continue to put effort and time into this connection or this relationship? And then you have here the lovers. Okay, so this could be a decision of the heart, right? Um, but also an energy with this lovers, you know, definitely see a relationship here where, you know, you're not feeling supported by this person, really showing me that you're not feeling supported by this person. And I feel like that's where you're having a hard time making a decision because there's an energy with this five of Raphael, not really feeling good about where you're at right now. Now, that, like I said, it could be around career, maybe feeling like, you know, maybe the money's not there or there's no long-term stability and it may be making you go within here to decide what do I really love to do um, and making a change, okay? So a decision from the heart. Some of you, this is about, I feel, maybe making a change in career, really maybe focusing your time on, you know, something that you love to do because you're not seeing the long-term stability. Some of you, I feel here, this is around a relationship, not feeling supported by somebody, okay? And and you're doing a lot of soul searching. So I do see some movement here with that Ada Gabrielle. So let's see what that's about. Oh, look at that. Okay, we have the wheel. Something's changing here, right? Could be a uh, Something surprise here, an element of surprise. Let's see what we have here. We got the King of Swords. And we got the Page of Swords. Okay. So you're going to get some communication here. There's some sort of change. Something happening. Um, <clears throat> let me see here. Okay, so I'm going to say with the wheel here, there's some sort of change that's about to happen. I feel like some of you are going to get some communication, important communication from somebody. You've got the King of Swords, okay? So there may be somebody here that you're going to get communication from. Now, for some, I feel um, this could be around uh, a, a relationship, some type of relationship here, and this is someone who may be coming forward with you with honesty and truth. <clears throat> okay, but this can also be about you really listening to listening to your wisdom here and um, being quite clear about what you want, right? Focusing on um, what you love to do. You also have the Page of Swords, okay? So some of you, this is really, I'm going to say with this Page of Swords here is really about you kind of investigating really what you want here, right? That soul searching. And some of you, I feel here, there could be some on and off communication here with someone. And this could be the someone, right, that you're feeling not supportive from. I do feel like you're going to get communication from this person. So maybe a surprise that you get communication. I'm going to pull um, a couple more cards. Capricorn, because I feel like we need more. Okay, look at that. Queen of Swords. Okay, so this is you protecting you and doing what's best for you. So some of you, this is around, right, communication with someone here. It feels like a partner here, right? Or it could just be somebody I feel that you've communicated with before. But I feel you're open to communicating with this person. And this is also about being clear about your intentions and what you want. You also have here... The King of Cups. Okay, so with this King of Cups, I do feel like there's going to be some good 
communication. I feel somebody here is going to be honest with you. It does feel like a kind energy, um, but also can be you expressing yourself, expressing yourself how you feel about the situation. And also, if you're trying to find a focus of a new career or business, this could be about you doing something in communications where you can express yourself or you can express yourself through something that you love to do is what I see there. And then look at that. You have the queen of coin. Really nice energy. Okay. So I feel like I'm going to get communication here from someone and I feel that you and this person are going to be able to express uh, some things to each other, investigate this, and it does feel like this could become something solid. Now, for some of you, that I feel this is around career, and if you're starting a business or a side business or you have a new offer here coming with this Queen of Pentacles, it's showing me you're going to do very well for yourself. So whether this is money, this is love here, but there's a need, I'm going to say, Spirit is saying with the Queen of Swords and that King of Cups, you need to express... There's something you're needing to express in the communication, okay? So some of you, if this is around, you know, your life purpose or just doing something that you love, you really need to investigate this because I feel like it will be good for you. It's a very stable, grounded, and prosperous energy. Now, for others, uh, if this is around some type of relationship, right, there needs to be some good communication. Some of you could even be new love or it could just be somebody that hear you that you are already dealing with. So let's pull some angel answer cards. So you can ask a question with this deck. It does have yes or no or just take the guidance. So let's see what the guidance is here for Capricorn. Look at that. Big, happy changes. Really nice. Oh, look at that. Opportunity falls in your lap. <laughs> look at all those golden nuggets falling down. So there's some sort of opportunity that is about to happen that's going to be really good for you. And that's what I was saying here. I feel a really nice energy here with this Queen of Pentacles doing very well for yourself, depending what your situation is, right? And look at that. The situation will improve. So you will see the light. The light is coming. All right. And look at that. You have it's up to you. Okay. So I feel like there's some sort of opportunity that is coming towards you, Capricorn. Some sort of communication. And I feel you're going to be able to either investigate this or express yourself about it. And it's really going to bring you to a better place. And some of you, it's a new career opportunity that's going to give you prosperity uh, for the future. And some of you, it can be around love. Okay, so being able to express yourself here with somebody um, that leads to more of a stable place. Okay, really, really nice. So we're going to pull... Um, some goddess guidance cards. We're going to see what the guidance is here for you, Capricorn. Okay, so you have uh, the card of White Terra, which is sensitivity. You are becoming increasingly sensitive. Avoid harsh relationships, environments, situations, and chemicals. Okay, so right now you may be very sensitive to things. Okay. You have here uh, Green Terra. This is, says start delegating. Ask others to help you instead of trying to do everything yourself. Okay, so you may be a giver, right? Maybe you give a whole lot, or you know you try to take on too much for yourself. Okay, you have to be a you have to be able to receive, and receiving too is also getting help from people. And then you ask, oh, here it is. Look at the card of Hathor, receptivity. Allow yourself to receive. This will increase your intuition, your energy, and, ab and ability to give to others. And that's what I was just saying here. You need to receive as well. And look at this. Bottom of the deck, you have Mother Mary. Expect a miracle. Have faith that your prayers have been heard and you are being answered. Okay, so really nice energy there for you, Capricorn. I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening, and I'm sending you angel love.